Hey, what is going on guys? I'm I Jordan B1409 and today I went on Black Ops 2 multiplayer for the first time in a while, mainly due to the fact that I was getting bored of online and when messing around, switching and testing things out in my custom classes, I came across a class which was actually really, really good. As you can see, I'm running the Emtar and they actually go on to get the Visa, Dogs and Swarm, which was especially good for me considering I haven't been online on Black Ops 2 for quite a while. The Emtar is no doubt one of my favourite assault rifles. The gun has very little recoil and very easy to handle at those further distances. This is the actual class setup, the Entire with the quick draw handle and reflex sight. Using perk 1 greed I then use ghost and hardline. Ghost is very effective as it keeps you hidden from enemies which is great because this means that um, the enemies will not know where you are when a UAV is in the air as there's nothing worse than getting killed, losing a kill streak or score streak due to a UAV in the air. Hardline is also a very, very useful perk. Hardline, as you already know, lowers score streaks by something like 20%, so you don't need as much points to reach those big score streaks. Toughness makes you flinch less when shot, which I believe is awesome with the MTAR, as it feels like there's no recoil whatsoever and can really help you out in those gunfights. And Scavenger, that is just simply because I just hate running out of bullets. In fact, you will see me run out of bullets with Scavenger in just a moment, as I didn't pick up ammo from dead bodies. And I had to get my ninja skills on actually to avoid dying, so um, enjoy that. Now dexterity allows you to aim fast enough to sprint in. That gains you a massive advantage over your enemies, as if you can get your shots off first, you are more, li than, li more than likely to get the kill. And that also helps you out in gunfights. You can also climb objects quicker, which can also come to great use. The school streets I like to use are the VSAT, Dogs and Swarm. Once you get the VSAT, you pretty much have a swarm, because VSAT gives you life positions of the enemies, and that is definitely a huge advantage. And after a VSAT, it's only something like 2 or 3 kills for dogs, which will then obviously um, then get you the swarm. So it's pretty much a turn reaction for those score streaks, and that's why I like using them. Now when I play online, I like to rush, and many people say that submachine guns are the best for rushing, but this MTAR class actually has a lot of quick movement. Being able to hip fire fast after sprinting, being able to aim in quick after sprinting, and being able to climb objects a lot more faster really does help you out when rushing. And this is the best, now this is the first ever class setup I've ever done, and I really hope this class setup has helped you out, and helped you get better on multiplayer. Now that's about it for this class setup guide, thank you for watching, don't forget to press the thumbs up button and post your thoughts on this class in the comment section below. You can click the video on screen which will be in there in a moment and that will take you to a new tab which will go to Black Ops 2 Zombies Wonder Weapons Confirmed for the Revolutionary uh, Revolution Map Pack. Now once again thank you for watching and I shall see you all in the next one, peace out. I hear the freeze, freeze, freeze come out